we're looking at is an HTML5 app that we built with the Google Web Toolkit. On the left side is Lars running Chrome. On the right side, I'm running Safari. And a little bit later, we're going to throw in Firefox. So the same thing is being shown on each pair of screens. You can just choose one to look at. OK, so we'll start with plain vanilla email type conversations, and we'll show you how it looks in Wave. We're planning a boat trip. And I'm going to start by clicking new Wave here, and then I'll type my title in the first line. Watch your spelling, Lars. There's a lot of people. <laughs> there is a lot of people. They can't see what I'm typing anyway. Are you ready for the boat trip? Hey, Steph. Did you guys like the spell checker? OK. We'll talk more about that later. Since you don't want to watch me type for an hour, we put canned messages in there. We'll try hard to pull them out before we launch. I click Done. It asks me for more users. I'll add Stephanie. And since she is offline, I'm going to go stare at a blank page. So I will open Wave. And you'll see in my search panel, the middle panel, there'll be an unread message from Lars. He's asking me if I want to go shopping. Uh, before this boat trip, so I'll do something very email-like, which is hit reply, and say, I love <laughs> shopping. I wrote the script. I need <laughs> new fins. Let's go. The first benefit I want to show you of this being a hosted conversation is it's easier to keep track of structure. If this was email and I wanted to reply to the middle part of Lars's message where he asked which bus to take, I would hit reply, the email client would copy the message, and I'd hand edit in the response. Because this is a hosted conversation and it lives in one place, I can just instruct the server to split the message apart and say, you never wake up early, which is true. Let's take the late bus. OK, Lars is in online. I'm going to close this wave. So a little bit later, I come back online. And you'll see, for starters, that that wave is now bold to show me there's new material in it. When I open it up, Stephanie's first message gets the highlight. And I can navigate the conversation with my keyboard and, of course, continue her thread here. You know me too well, like that. And that's how plain vanilla email type conversations work in Wave. 